folks, welcome aboard the channel, Rockin' a Country. I'm Don, I am doing a request of Junior Brown's Highway Patrol. That's why I'm wearing this hat. Travis Dean and Mike Barnett requested this, so shout out to you fellas. Thank you for the request. And let's see what Junior's got for us. Here we go. <laughs> A fitting beginning. I got a star on my car and one on my chest. A gun on my hip and the right to arrest. I'm the guy who's the boss on this highway. So watch out what you're doing when you're driving my way. If you break the law, you'll hear from me. I know I'm a working for the state. I'm the highway patrol. All right. Well, you'll know me when you see me because my door is painted white. With my siren is screaming and my flashing red light. I, hate I work that. all day and I work all night Just to keep them on order trying to do what's right If I write you out a ticket then you better drive slow I'm just a doing my job on the highway patrol I'm the highway patrol, the highway patrol My hours are long and my pay is low But I'll do my best to keep you driving slow I'm just a doing my job on the highway patrol it is so hard to try. You know what? They should have. They. I've been saying this for a while now. With the braking technology, the increased technology in vehicle control, stabilization, and all that, they could increase the speed limits. I mean, my favorite state to drive in is West Virginia. My least favorite is right next to it, Virginia. They patrol those roads very differently. Virginia. State Patrol are like the Nazis of the United States in terms of traffic enforcement. And West Virginia cops are the coolest ones. New Jersey cops are cool, too. All right, here we go. Maryland cops are pretty cool, too. Wow. If you're driving too fast like you shouldn't do, you can bet your boots I'm coming after you. If you want to race, then get on a racetrack. Or if you try to run away, I'm going to bring you back. I'm here to keep all those Peter driving slow. I'm just doing my job on the highway patrol. Jerry Lee Lewis feel. Highway patrol, highway patrol. My hours are long and my pay is low, but I'll do my best to keep you driving slow. I'm just a doing my job on the highway patrol. I'm just a doing my job on the highway patrol. <laughs> I love that. When a songwriter decides I'm going to write a song, a very one about one little simple thing in life, cop keeping people driving slow. I mean, there's so many different ways you could characterize that. Like somebody gets an idea, says, I want to write a song about cops. What do I want to choose? I want to choose murders. I want to choose homicide. I want to choose bank theft. I want to, what? No, I think I want to do traffic traffic patrol we can all relate to it so I, I don't want to do a scary song like murder i want to do something that we can relate to keep it going up temp but you still got to decide how you're going to depict it and is it in a small town is it going to be on the highway and when the song all comes together there's all kinds of thought usually that's gone into it not always sometimes the song just writes itself instantly like maybe a person's getting a ticket and they're like oh crap while well, the cops checking my my uh, my record back there in his car then i'm gonna pen this thing out real quick or whatever or you write it right afterwards or later that day after you get done being pissed off and embarrassed because everybody stares at you when you're pulled over but that is what they do it's their job it, it does feel like going slow i could tell you like i know here in jersey on the highways if it's a 65 you can drive 80 as long as you're not weaving and driving like a jackass they'll leave you be it's very simple if you're doing 90, 
you're going to get pulled over. If you're doing 85, depends on the cop and where you're at. Maybe, maybe not. 80, 82, you're generally pretty cool. People who weave, talking on their cell phone, they're getting pulled over. That's an easy one. But different states have different things. And But the thing is, man, when people drive slow in the fast lane, or it's really technically called the passing lane, but we call it the fast lane. If you've got a three-lane highway, you got the slow lane on the right, keep up with traffic, and then some in the middle, and then, and then the fast lane. And if somebody pulls up on your bumper, get over in the other lane. doesn't matter if they're going 100 miles an hour. Get out of the way. But the cop's job, it does feel like to keep you going slow. The slow drivers, they're like, oh, I'm so glad the cops are there to keep all these jackasses from going so fast. I don't understand the point to driving slow. <laughs> I never have. But I... What a, in, in residential neighborhoods, I do the speed limit or under. Like, I do not speed in residential neighborhoods because, God forbid, you don't want to hit anybody, kids on bikes coming out and whatnot. But on the highway, it's a different ballgame. Travis and Mike, I'm going to rate this song. That was a fun day to a song. They stayed in the pocket. The picking on that thing was re- picking or strumming or both was ridiculous, man. He reminded me of Roy Clark just getting after it. I like this voice, I like the tempo. The number, and it engaged me. I wanted to hear what it was about. I thought maybe the song was going to take a direction where it's like, I'm the boss on the highway, but when I get home, my wife's the boss. I thought that might have been, that was a strong contender in my brain, but he just stayed in the pocket. The number that popped into my head on this was an 8.8. It was a very crisp, clean song, uh, instrumentally, and I loved his voice. He went right along with it, too, so... There we go. Another Junior Brown song. That was like my third or fourth one, I think. Yeah. All right, guys. Have a great day. I'll see you on another video. Keep rocking the country.